Hello everyone, Tech1421 here alongside my friend Kevin. Howdy everybody. And we are playing the group mode, group event <coughs> mode in Super Smash Bros. for the Wii U. And this is, I think, the hardest event mode out there, which is the really? ultimate battle. And I'm Bowser, Kevin is... Greninja. Greninja. And we put on some special equipment. The one that we put on was we got... Every time we got a KO, like we just did right there, you'll notice I got 15% health back. Um, so that's huge in this because you have to battle every single character. So In the whole game. In the whole game. Exactly. Including the unlockable characters. Yes. So it really adds up. Um, the Getting the health back is huge. The strategy that we did is we basically went with the 15% the health back. We also started with 30% health. And that increases our attack by 1.15 times. So, so that, that also adds up to, we figured that we'd eventually get back to 0% anyway, so the starting out with 30% wouldn't really matter too much. Exactly. Also, the 30% health item, uh, with the increase of attack, also gives you some defense back too. So, exactly. Um, it helps out in those regards as well. It lowers the speed, Bowser doesn't really need the speed, Greninja kind of needs speed, because it's he's kind of a speedy character, but regardless, it was still very fun. It took us a long time to do this, and that's that's an understatement. It <laughs> took us about, I want to say, two hours, two and a half hours. We just kept on trying out new combos, new equipment items, and it just it was kind of crazy. And then it just clicked. It just clicked. Um, the there's I, I don't know how many characters there are on Smash, but you see the the line of the characters in the top left hand corner, and Falco gave me a hard time, and I'm glad that we KO'd him right away. What seemed to happen a lot of the time was we'd be rolling pretty smoothly and then there'd just be two set of characters that would just rack up a ton of damage on us and we'd never be able to recover. Yeah. Uh, throughout the entire time here, we went pretty smoothly and you'll see that we actually got back to 0% zero, zero health or stamina, whatever you want to call it. Twice. Um, twice in, in the entire time that we were doing this. And that was a little bit later on, which is kind of crazy because you, you would think in a, in a challenge like this, You'd be at a hundred plus stamina towards the end of it, but mm -hmm. we were actually going pretty strong the entire time yeah. thanks to the equipments. Um, so I definitely recommend trying out the uh, group stages for yourself as I get a nice double kill there. <laughs> uh, you see, Green Ninja's at seventy-three percent. I think that's pretty much the highest you got. Yeah, it was. And I got up to maybe at the very end when we we're playing against Diddy, uh, Donkey Kong, and Mario. I got up to like the sixty or something like that, but. For the most part, I was near zero the whole time. I was getting a lot of KOs. I think Bowser's one of the best for this, if not the best character to use. I know Ganondorf is also very good. Anyone that has a powerful smash attack that can KO in one hit is really nice. I was basically using my forward smash and my up smash the whole time. I don't know what you were using. I think you were using your water shuriken. Yeah, and... I was using water shuriken most of the time as distance, and then when everyone... When anybody was above me on one of those platforms, I would just up smash them, and that pretty much killed them most most of the time. Did you use your forward smash at all too, or was, is that the water shuriken? The water shuriken was the um, side B. Oh, okay, so that's your special. Yeah, that was my side special. I gotcha. I, I didn't use my for I didn't use my forward smash that much. So we're actually more than halfway through now. I th there's six <laughs> lines of enemies, and we are in I guess on the the third or the fourth, whatever you want, however you yeah. want to put it, uh, line of enemies now. And the the lighter characters are the easier ones for Bowser to KO. So I tried to go after those as soon as I saw them uh, because guys like Jigglypuff and I guess Olimar right here and you know just lighter characters, if you just hit them twice with an up smash on Bowser, they're gone. They're out of the field of out play of <laughs> pretty easily. So right here we're at 0% and 13%. Uh, Diddy Kong or not Diddy Kong? King Who's DDD. This? King DDD gave me a hard hard time in, in past event modes as well. Just, just because him. I can't really get near him. You see here, he's actually getting some pretty good stamina on me. Um, but luckily enough, I do manage to get a double kill there, Again. put myself back to zero percent, <laughs> and Greninja is also getting near zero as well. Uh, something that was kind of weird. Sometimes I would go for a smash, and Greninja would just like barely hit him, and it would give give Greninja the KO, which I'm fine with as long as I'm at 0%, <laughs> but you know, we, we definitely want to try to get, get both of ourselves at 0% as, yeah. as near that as possible 
during the course of this game. But through clearing the ultimate battle, as this one's called, you get a lot of gold. I think it was 10,000 gold. As you'll see at the end. And prior to this gameplay on my channel, I have three of the more tougher, uh, I guess, challenge modes up to this one that we, we went up against. Mm -hmm. So if you want to check out those, as we're at zero zero right now, as <laughs> promised, so that's pretty awesome there. Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> it was definitely really tough to get to zero zero. You uh -huh. have to get a lot of KOs. A lot of things have to go right. And this is our first time fighting these characters in this one. And, like, we got down to this part of the event, and things just, I guess, clicked, like Kevin yeah. said. Uh, where we just kind of rolled through them and I don't know if it was just like it gets a little bit easier as time goes on maybe uh, But this is on hard difficulty if you did not notice that um, For the challenge in this one every, every event mode has a challenge and for the challenge in this one you had to beat it on hard Which was very tough yeah. to say the least being every single character on hard difficulty I'm not really sure what I guess a skill level they're at if they're at like nine or eight or so uh, but they're definitely high up there as far as oh, their yeah. skill level, and you can definitely tell. It took a while to get used to. For sure. Uh -huh. um, I do not think we could have beaten this, as I said earlier, without the equipments. No. So be sure if you're going to try doing this for yourself, try to find some good equipment combos to use. We used, like we said earlier, the... They were like KO... KO it was like, healer. Yeah, it, it was a it was a green. It was a, it was um, a KO, speed move. KO healer glider badge, I think it was called. And then the other one, it was a defense item. It was like a takeaway protection badge or something like that. That gave you. It basically just gave you uh, some more protection. It gave you. It you started your life with thirty percent stamina, but it, you got more attack. Yeah, it boosted your attack. So right here is the last person, Mario, and like I said earlier, Mario and uh, Donkey Kong gave us a little bit of trouble somehow. Yeah. I guess we were just a little bit nervous. We got down to the final person. And when we got to Donkey Kong and Mario, it didn't take... It took me a while to realize that Mario was the last one until Donkey Kong was knocked out. And then I noticed that nobody else was coming back on. I was like, oh. <laughs> but there we go. We <laughs> cleared all the stages. <laughs> I got the, the KO on Mario, and 10,000 gold, which is crazy. Mm. Uh, also, you'll see here in a second, we have we got all the Ka challenges. Um, we, we got all the, what, is, what are they called? All the requirements Reward for all the group stages. So we do hope you guys enjoyed. Have any final thoughts, Kevin? Uh, well, I just wanted to add that it took us a long time, and when we actually finished, we were in awe. And we were. We were very happy. And we were exhausted. We were definitely mentally and physically exhausted. <laughs> and it was like one o'clock in the morning yeah. when we finished it. We started at like eleven. Not even. <laughs> not even joking. No. Um, so we do hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see everyone later. Peace. Bye. -bye.